Hi, so this is video two of what we were talking about uh, purebred breeders. Uh, so uh, basically on their website it does state that we do not allow any breeder to post puppies on our website but have to go through a systematic process in screening before breeders uh, can post on there. Less than 20% of the breeders we screen are approved to join our network. Once approved, we work with our breeders to ensure that they adhere to any company's policies. If you saw on the previous uh, video, anybody can open an account, try it for yourself. Uh, it is bullshit. It's lies, 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 lies. They're doing business out of a P.O. box. They're registered as an LLC, which means an LLC means you cannot do anything. Even if you if you sue them, they could just go get bankrupt and open a new company, and then nobody's responsible for it. Uh, nothing but bad reviews. Uh, people heartbroken, heartbroken, and disappointed. Uh, that um, people have been, you know, they wish that would have they would have done their homework. They paid twenty seven twenty six hundred dollars for a puppy, um, and then, you know, just sad. It's just sad that they keep ripping off people. They're just brokers. They're they don't care about the dog safety. They don't do anything. All they care about is the twenty three hundred dollars that you're gonna pay which more than half of the chunk is actually theirs. And this person had to pay $600 in expenses, plus the dog. And they only offered her $60 in a $25 gift card. Wow. I don't know. It's just upsetting, because I'm an animal lover myself, and this is bullshit. Um, but again, they supposedly thrive, and being nothing but the best. They're getting sued left and right. They have uh, videos of being a puppy mill through the Humane Society, as you can see here. Puppy mill. In humane facilities where dogs are forced to overbreed in squalid or substandard conditions. Purchase a puppy on the internet, and this is where your dog will probably come from. And the seller? likely to be a company called Purebred Breeders, or PBB. Chances are, if you go online looking to buy a dog, you're going to end up doing business with PBB. This is the new way for puppy mills to do business, increasingly over the internet. A nationwide HSUS investigation found that the cute pictures listed with PBB, promising consumers healthy puppies raised by caring, professional breeders, are often anything but that kept like a cash crop. Animals that live in small wire cages with little or no socialization often stack one on top of the other. In some cases, the animals above defecating onto the animals below. No veterinary care. Nothing that you would normally associate with the natural raising of dogs. But the deception doesn't end there. Investigators found that PBB dominates the internet puppy selling marketplace, running more than 800 websites each marketing every breed of dog in every state. For example, if a consumer searches for a California Maltese puppy, a PBB website pops up. But the dogs listed are not necessarily bred in California, rather bred in one of the hundreds of puppy mills that supply PBB. Internet sales are skyrocketing, and the damages to consumers and the harm to the dogs are going up right along with it. With many puppies arriving sick or even dying, but now consumers across the country are taking action. They've filed suit under state fraud laws, state laws designed to protect consumers, saying, look, this business is in the system of pushing puppy mill dogs on unsuspecting consumers. They're telling lies, they're making misrepresentations, and people are losing money and suffering because of it hoping future consumers won't fall for the company's false claims and supporting a business built on the misery of dogs. So the there reality you go, is people. these websites are set up in order That's to sad. dupe consumers into buying dogs that they otherwise wouldn't buy. 
So just think about it, people. Um, I'm not here to mess up anybody's reputation. I'm just puppy milk. Um, like I said, I was just here to make.